Kia ora, welcome to my happy place. If you like today's video, please give me a thumbs up, leave a comment so I know that you've been, don't be shy, and please enjoy. I was just having a little glue in my book, my, my roly poly poly, and I did the cover on the other night, and um, then I thought, oh, I really should. I've lost my page. Um, turn the camera on. So, um, bring you along for a little gluing session. Just thought I needed to come in and just give a little glue session. And I thought, well, why not turn the computer on? Might be somebody out there who just wants to have a glue session with me. Oh, it's just um, semi um, fussy cutting out these images the other night, and I thought, oh, well, I've got these cut out, I might as well, you know, put them in my book. This has been a very chilly day here today. one of those days that I haven't we haven't done much because it was so cold I like that this bottle of bubbly here so I will put that there as well Done on this page. Let's come along and glue some stuff down. This is so cool, so cute. I, I might just give it a bit of a give it a bit of a cut off. Oh, so. We had another couple of, of three deaths yesterday from the virus. They were also elderly people in their 90s and 80s. One in, one in their 70s. But um, the actual um, amount of cases are slowing down and we've now got more people recovered from the virus that are actually and have actually got the virus so that's looking positive so I'm going to put this on here I'm going to cut it a bit short after all that but that's okay because I've got some new things I want to play with while I'm doing this as well. Um, I got money for my birthday and so I spent some of it. On half a dozen woodies. It came in the um, came by courier today. So these are what I got. Red, green, blue, yellow, black, and a peachy colour. This one is I think. Yeah, it looks like a sort of like a fleshy colour one. Hmm. It's actually quite pretty then. So, I was quite excited to get those. And where else did I buy? Um, I bought these um, little um, bottles for glue with the um, with the little wider metal bit on them. So I got a couple of those. So 
um, pencil sharpener came with the woolies. And what else did I get? Oh, a little bottle of repositional Tombow multi glue. So that's what I bought with my money off my sister for my birthday. So I was quite wrapped with that. So I just got some bits of paper. I was doing some, I'm just going to show you this. I don't know if anybody can see it. Can you see the cat? Or is the, I don't know whether it's a cat or some sort of, but it's like an eye there and the face and a, its ears and its back. I was doing jelly printing and that came out and I thought, oh, that is so cool. Right, what have I got here? Just some bits of paper that I'm going to use. So, the kids did their first day of online schooling today. That seemed to have gone well. So that's cool. Just put some bits down here. Right, here's my glue. So, other than that, there is not much going on. This we might as well put it down. What is the time? It is eleven o'clock at night. Yeah. Oops. Just not going where I want it to. Straighter. So we hopefully will be finding out next week whether the isolation rules will be um, softened a little bit. But then they're saying that the over 70s could be knocked down for a couple of months more because of their vulnerability. So I'm not a I am not a frail over 70 so hopefully they will be a little bit um, a little bit 
um, lenient on who they expect to keep in isolation and who they don't. I'll just give this a bit of a trim so it and cover our lady's face, hopefully. Yeah. Just trim this off a bit. Take this out a bit. Right, and on the side where his foot is, needs to be trimmed a bit. Uh, it's quite pretty, I thought. All right, and that can go there. So, not that I mind staying at home. I'm not really a going out person when we're at home. But when you can't, I really would like to be able to go and do my own shopping. It would be nice. Right. Oh. Okay, I'm moving a little bit of a trim. I might have him there. And they are making it easier for the elderly to go shopping. You don't have to line up if you're over 65 and have a gold card, which is a, a card you get when you're over 65. And on the pension here, they issue with you with one of those and you get cheaper cheaper things at certain stores, discounts at certain stores and things like that. So um, you just have to show that and you can go straight in and do your shopping at the front of the line and um, you don't have to line up to go through the checkout. You can just jump the line, which is quite cool. A little bird here. Give it a little trim. So it would be nice, but because I have a respiratory problem and it hasn't been very good, as you know, lately, I've been taking this particular cough medicine, which is really good. I'm just about out of it, so I asked my daughter in law, would she go to the chemist and buy me some? But because I've got a cough, I had to get in touch with my doctor, but because I suffer with this all the time, it was on my records. So they just um, emailed to the chemist to say yes, that I could have it. But because I've been so, so um, poorly for so long, because it's been a few months now, They've written me a prescription for antibiotics and prednisone so I can get on top of it. So that's cool. Mm, I'm liking that. Oh, what else have we got here? Might find something to go on there at a later date. We'll move to the back a bit, I think. Let me see what we've got here. Let's Oh, if I want to do those, those, I'll just put those aside for now. It's a little patchwork quilt here. Yeah, so we'll be finding out more about that. Quite some time that I'm picking. I'm just going to give 
give this a little trim. Down there, I think. Instead of throwing it out. Right, I'll put it this way. Interesting. Let's put that thing out and then trim it off about. Put that level. And trim it off about there, I think. about. Hmm. Bethany's doing re reasonably well with her Crohn's disease but she's having trouble sleeping so I've got to get on to that. The other girls are all doing well. It's a bit busy, I think, for that one. I think I'm going to put her here. She's very very, very striking this here. And I'll put her oh, interesting maybe on the back too. daughter and more to um pick me up some glue sticks next time she's at the supermarket. Sometimes cut these things to fit yourself just to go where you want them to go. a little bit of scrape off paper that I was using.
That's all right. my father would say. when it doesn't um, go right down to where you want it to go. No, not yet. Right. Just glue some stuff down. Just glue some stuff down. and just glue something down.
these are out of the stained glass one notebook There we go. Right, what else have we got here? Let's take this little bit off the side. Yeah, just a little bit here, I think.
I've come on to do a flip through because I was doing a good gluing video last night and I got carried away and after about half an hour I forgot to talk and I glued away for about two hours so I've done my video up to where I stopped talking and now I'm just going to do a flip through of what I did. And this was the first page I did. And this one here. It took me quite a while to find birds to, to go on this page. Um, this was just a grab and glue page. This one. This one, this one I'd already done, but I did add that to it. This one, I just added paint up the top there. I don't think that's actually glued in. I think I just popped it there. So we'll just glue that in. It says, what a lovely meditating lady. I think I did this page in the early stages before I stopped talking. This one. And this. Yep, and I'm pretty sure that's, that was all of it. So it's starting to get nice and fat and this page I did, um, the cover I did um, one night where I didn't bring my video down and it's roly poly poly. This, somebody sent me this card in a um, happy mail so I just covered it and this little hair clip um, embellishment Somebody sent me that as well. So that was my little flip through. Thank you for being with me. Kia kaha, stay strong, and I'll catch you again soon.